Have you ever wanted to drive a European car in America? Well, now you can. This brand new Ford Focus is the very same car that you can buy in Europe starting this summer. Let's take it for a drive and see if it fulfills the European driving experience. Goodbye, frumpy, frugal, and mundane. Hello, good looking. Let me cut to the chase. The three words that I would use to best describe the 2012 Ford Focus are sexy, sassy, and quiet. What I'm immediately struck by driving this new 2012 Focus is just how quiet it is. Listen, you hear anything? Neither do I. This car sounds like a much more expensive car. Why did Ford go from having you know, an American specific Focus to now having one Focus worldwide? Well, we really think that customer expectations and desires around the globe are converging. And they're really converging around a couple different themes, one being great fuel economy and lower CO2 emissions, and another being interior quietness and fun to drive. The new Ford Focus certainly aspires to fun, with direct linear steering, confidence-inspiring brakes, and perhaps one of the best automatic six-speed transmissions I've recently had the good fortune to drive. It's really fun to, to drive it in sport mode, especially on these, uh, these type of surfaces we're on right now. And uh, it helps you hold the vehicle a little bit more in gear, like you indicated, near the red line. While the fancy dual clutch automatic transmission is a real gem, the standard 2 liter 4 cylinder engine that gets 160 horsepower and 40 miles to the gallon on the highway, well, it's certainly adequate, but fun? Well, that's a bit of a stretch. It starts at uh, $16,250. On our high-end titanium models, which is just loaded with great features, uh, the, the, uh, the price is up to uh, around $23,000. Perhaps the most interesting of those features? The Ford Focus will park itself. There's a, there's a button on the console you press and the car will detect if there's a space available for you and when it detects that it tells you where to stop the car and at that point you basically take your hands off the wheel uh, and you put it in reverse gear and the car will basically park for itself. You, you need to use the brakes before you hit the car behind you and then stop and then pull forward. But you see the, the wheels turning itself so basically all you control is the brakes and the accelerator and uh, the car you become the best parker in the world. Look at that, it, it, within inches from hitting the back of the car but yet it stops. And yes, I get it, you can certainly park the car yourself, but you know what, you can also wash the car yourself. But for me, I find it more fun to watch when the car wash does it. Ford is very proud of the interior, and yes, it's very good, but not quite up to the best in class Audi. Ford Focus will go from 0 to 60 in just under 8 seconds. In Europe, they get several engine choices including a diesel. We, well, we just get one. That is until the Hot Hatch ST version arrives with Ford's EcoBoost 247 horsepower power plant. Now that one sounds like a lot more fun. At this point, you might be wondering, should I go and buy a new 2012 Ford Focus? Well, honestly, after only driving the car for two hours, I can't really say, but I can recommend that you go test drive one. Roman Micah here in California, reporting for tflcar.com.